questions or any injuries, um, any instructions by an allied health professional, doctor, physio, any of that kind of stuff, please do follow those instructions and work within your own experience levels. So let's get started with a little bit of a warm up. You won't be needing any equipment today guys, but you can add a weight in um, to any of the exercises if you wanna make them a little bit harder, but you definitely don't need them. Beautiful. And let's get some arms going. shoulder rolls to the back and to the front let's get some trunk rotations going so we're twisting all the way around pivoting on that outside foot getting a nice twist through the torso getting nice and warm you might get a couple back cracks with this one Beautiful. All right, so coming down to our mat, the next thing we're gonna do, we're just gonna tuck the knees into the chest, hold the arms, hands on just below the knees, and we're just gonna rock back and forth, get that lower back nice and warm. Beautiful. All right, so now let's lay down. And we're just gonna move the legs from side to side. Again, stretching out that lower back. Beautiful, all right. I hope everyone is nice and warm and ready to go. So today, guys, we have Supersets again, because everybody loves them. <laughs> We've got five different sets of exercises and we're just gonna be jumping straight in from one to another. And I'm adding a little bit of a challenge in today. So after the end of each superset, we're going to do 10 crunches. So we've got 45 seconds on with a tiny little transition um, break to get to the next exercise. Then we're gonna do our 10 crunches. Then we're going to do the whole set again, 10 crunches, and then we're done with that set and we'll move on to the next one. So if we want to get ready, our first set of exercises, we've got... Oh, give me two seconds, I need the password for the iPad. about that technical difficulty guys so first set of exercises we've got our hip dips so coming down into your plank we're going to drop the hips down to the side stop just before we touch the floor and back to middle with this one guys you want to make sure the bum is nice and low to the ground we don't want to be coming up like this come down nice flat back nice tight core that's our first one. Our second one is Spider-Man planks. So for this one, you can come up into a high plank. Hands are just beneath the shoulders. We're bringing the knee to elbow and back out. So if you want to get ready, guys, going for our first set of exercises in three, two, one, 45 seconds. Let's go. Making sure you're breathing through it. When you come back up, really use that core to pull yourself back up. You're going to feel this all in your obliques. 15 seconds to go. And five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Straight into our Spider-Man planks. In three, 
in two, one, let's go. If you want to make this one a little bit easier, guys, just bring the leg out and don't come all the way into the elbow. You're going to feel this in the shoulders as well. 25 seconds to go. Really transfer that weight so that the weight is in the hands. Last 10 seconds. By the way, this mat is amazing. It's like a mixture of a yoga mat and a towel all in one. Would highly recommend. <laughs> Okie dokie. And take a couple more breaths and we're gonna go back into our hip dips. The brand is Yoga Lab Design if anyone's interested. Alrighty, and back to your hip dips in three, two, one, let's go. Breathe through it, make sure you're not putting any strain on the neck. The neck is nice and neutral the entire time. 25 seconds to go. Fifteen seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. And straight into our Spider Man planks in three, two, one. Off we go. Hello, pumpkin. <laughs> Twenty-five seconds to go here. Keep pushing. Keep your bum nice and low. Last ten seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Whew. Amazing! And finish it off with our crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, keep breathing, eight, nine, and ten. Whew. First set done. First set done, four to go. <laughs> Alrighty, so guys, our next set of exercises, just grab a drink. Have a little breather and I'll demonstrate the next two. So first one we've got is a reverse crunch. So with our reverse crunch, we're really going to be grounding those hands, really using those hands to push off the ground and for some, some <laughs> I'll try that again, for some support. So we're going to come up, push those feet up towards the sky and slowly lower and then I want you to stop just before the ground and back up and slowly lower so when you're coming down guys you really want to control it on the way down you're going to feel this one for sure next one we've got 
is knee to max. So we're just going to come straight up. Hands are going to be, uh, fingers are going to be pointing towards your toes. Extend the legs out straight and tuck them in. Out straight and tuck them in. Again, not resting. Keeping those legs up the entire time. And knee tucking. All right, hope we're all ready. This one's going to be a killer. <laughs> Again, we are going to do our crunches at the end of each set. Sorry, at the end of each round. And going in three, two, one, reverse crunches. Let's go. So really think about coming up and rather than all the way over, you just want to have those legs straight up to the sky and then lowering down nice and slow and control. Keep breathing. And we've got 15 seconds to go. Really good for those bottom abs, this one. And last five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Coming up, going straight into our knee tucks. In three, two, one. Straight away, let's go. If you do need to drop it down, guys, and have a break at any point, that's totally fine. Or you can just do one leg at a time. <laughs> Last 20 seconds. Ten seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Let's finish off with our 10 crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more, nine, ten. Alrighty, guys. Have a little break and then we're going to do that one more time. If you are drinking water, just small little sips. You don't want to bring it back up, trust me. <laughs> I've made that mistake before. <laughs> Alrighty, back into our reverse crunches. In three, two, one, off we go. Remember, you really want to control it on the way down. Beautiful. Just check the timer. 20 seconds to go. Again, if you do need to drop at any point and just go one leg, that's totally okay as well. 20 more seconds. Last 10 seconds. Go, go, go. And five, four, three, two, one. Let's finish it off with our crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Woo! Second round done. Three to go. Whew. All 
right, take a breath, guys. Next set we have diamond sit-ups and ankle taps. I shall demonstrate. So, diamond sit-ups. Feet are going to be together. So, I don't know if you can see. Feet are going to be together like this. You're going to come all the way down. Make sure you get that stretch and using that momentum. And then come all the way up. If this is too much, which it might be, especially after we've done all those other core exercises before this one, we can just do diamond crunches. But if you can, I really want you to use that power, use that momentum, and really propel yourself up. If you want to, you can use like a medicine ball or a weight or something, and it really it can help you with that momentum. That's the first one. Second one you've got is ankle taps. So coming down, we're going to reach around, reach for the outside of the ankle and changing sides. With this one, you don't want to be moving from the hips, you want it to all be through the core. So really getting that crunch in your obliques. Uh, if you want to make it a bit easier, bring the feet out nice and wide and you're not reaching as far. You want to make it harder, bring the feet in closer together. Again, we are going to be finishing with our 10 crunches at the end of each set. And let's go with our diamond sit-ups in three, two, one. Off we go, guys. With these ones, you do want to nice and control it down. You don't want to be stumping down to the ground and hurting your back. Nice and controlled. And then power on the way up. 25 seconds to go. Another option here, guys, you can just do your normal sit ups. You might find those ones a little bit easier. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful ankle taps in three, two, one. Let's do it. Thirty seconds to go. Making sure that you've got a nice neutral neck in this one, guys. So you don't want to be straining your neck too much. Just have the chin tucked in towards the chest. You've got ten seconds. And five, four. Three, two, one, and let's go into our 10, oh, there we go, 10 crunches. Off we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. All right, have a rest. You can do that one more time. All righty, and going in. Three, two, one. Diamond sit-ups. Off we go. Remembering to control it on the way down. 20 seconds to go. Last 10 seconds here. And five, four, three, two, one. Ankle taps, let's go.
Good job, guys. Keep breathing. Got 20 seconds to go. Ten seconds and five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Finishing off the round without crunches. Ten crunches. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, amazing. Third set done, two more to go. Next set of exercises we have, we've done all these ones before, ration twist and a V hold. All right guys, getting ready for our ration twist. In three, two, one, off we go. So first option, feet are on the ground, leaning back, and gently twisting it around. So just stop just before you touch the floor, let the head follow so you're not straightening the neck. Second option, if you want to make it harder, lift the legs up. Holding that V. Got 20 seconds to go here. Last 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Finishing off with our 10 crunches. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Have a little break. Then we're going to do that one more time. Good news, guys. We're almost at the end. We've got one more set of exercise after this, and we are done. Alrighty, going for our Russian twist in three, two. One, let's do it. <laughs> Good baby. Good girl. And lift those legs up for the next challenge. seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and resting. Whew. Behold in three, two, one. Let's do it. Remember if your legs or cord does get tired, you can lower those legs to the floor and hold. Just make sure you're keeping tension in that core the entire time. You might get a little shake here and there, that's okay. You should keep those hands off and hold. You've got 25 seconds left, guys, you can do it. Breathe through it. Last 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Finishing off 
with our crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job, guys. Alrighty, last set of exercises. We've got plank reaches and plank hold. So we've got plank reaches. You have the option to either be <laughs> either be on your toes or on your knees and reaching one arm out at a time. And if you are on the toes, like that. Alrighty guys, let's go, plank reaches. In three, two, one, off we go. nice and tight. Coming up onto the toes if you want that extra challenge. Bring the feet out nice and wide. I want bum down and reaching it out. Keeping those hips nice and still. 15 seconds to go. And resting. Coming into our plank in three, two, one. Let's do it. Nice and strong through those shoulders. Hold, hold, hold. Drop it down to the knees if you need to. Want, don't want bums up. Keep that bum down, core tight. Glutes tight, shoulders tight. Last 15 seconds. 10. And five, four, three, two, one, and resting. Let's go into our crunches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Amazing. One more round, and we are done. Whew, okay, going in, three, two, one, plank reaches, let's go. Let's finish it up strong, guys. If you want that extra challenge, you can bring it down to the elbows and reaching out that way. 25 seconds to go. Last 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Straight into our plank. Last plank, 45 seconds, let's go, hold. You've got this, last exercise. 30 seconds to go. You might be feeling a little bit of a shake, that's good, it means we've worked. Last 20 seconds.
You might be feeling a little sore tomorrow. If you want to keep stretching, guys, please feel free to. Otherwise, I will see you next time.